anyways, um, this song is another one off that record. Uh, I wrote this song for my wife Chrissy because she's hot and I like her and I want to make out with her. Right now, I would if she was here, I would leave. I would be gone. So, but I just want to say this. Uh, <laughs> she's so good looking. Like it's a little bit offensive to me. A little bit. Oh, okay, anyway, so uh, I, I know what it is to lose a marriage. I got divorced real young. And I also know what I know what it is to be an adulterer and break up a marriage. And I know what it is to lose a marriage due to adultery. And having one of my friends have my wife fall in love with one of my friends, man. It sucked really bad. And so I know what it is to lose a marriage. So I know what it is to have one now. And I just want to tell you guys something. Marriage is supposed to be heaven on earth. It's supposed to be awesome. And if you're here tonight and your marriage is in trouble, if you're a dude and your marriage is in trouble and your wife isn't here, go home. Like, go home. Get out of here. Go take care of that because no one else is going to have your marriage for you. And the hardcore scene certainly doesn't care about your marriage at all. They just care if you're Martian. Anyway, so this song is called Covenant. It's because I back marriage. I believe in romance. And it's my favorite, favorite, favorite thing. But, um... There's a lot of Christians that are blowing it. You're getting married to get laid. Just get laid. Don't get married. All right? Because then you'll make marriage look like a joke. Okay? Just have sex if you're going to be in sin. It's fine. Just do that. But don't get hitched. Don't get married and then make covenant look like a joke. All right? And then point our finger at other people and be like, you shouldn't get married. Really, we shouldn't be getting married if we don't know what we're doing with it. So, okay. This song's called covenant. We're... <laughs> 